Hey there, so here we are on the blocky conspiracy map, the Sherlock Holmes mystery, and we are dressed for the part, and I am in, I'm assuming this is our, where we uh, do our business, what, what was it, on Baker Street, oh well, because also my first clue was, open the intro for Baker Street. So let's go ahead and watch that real quick. In all my time working with my friend Sherlock Holmes, no case has ever showed itself to be as complicated or with more devious plot. The case of the blocky conspiracy, when a priceless diamond block went missing from Bernard Mansion, nearly baffled even the sharp mind of Sherlock Holmes. I remember it like it was just a few days ago. I had gone to Baker Street to visit Holmes when I was caught on the street by a messenger. After a quick conversation, I headed up to Holmes' room and found him lying stretched out in front of the fire, as he was often was, his violin lying nearby. Little did I know that that messenger had started when he stopped me on the street, or that we were entering a case that would nearly cost us the lives of all of London, or perhaps the world. Holmes, wake up! I wasn't sleeping, Watson. Then what were you doing exactly? I was concentrating. I believe... I believe I had just made a monumental scientific discovery. And what would that be? I have discovered a compound that will identify previously undetectable poisons. Splendid! However, for now, we have work to do. And what work are you referring to? We have no open cases. A messenger met me at the door. Let me wager a guess. He was from Bernard Mansion and wanted my aid in finding their rare diamond block, which was just recently found to be missing. Incredible! How did you deduce it? Elementary, my dear Watson. You have that slip of paper there that it is the exact color and observable texture as that made by used by the folks at Bernard Mansion. Also, your tone had a note of urgency, suggesting the case was important. And finally, the diamond block is one of the most well-guarded treasures at the mansion, meaning it is also the only thing they would need my help in locating because of how difficult it would be to steal. Impressive, as usual, Holmes. Now shall we go? Yes, let us leave. The way to Bernard Mansion is simple. All we must do is to turn left out of our humble abode, head down the street, and take a right onto Mayweather Street. Then the mansion is simply in sight from there. Alright, so that was Watson telling us that they're on a case that even baffles Sherlock, and it has to do with the Bernard Mansion. So we're supposed to go find the Bernard Mansion and talk to the people that live there apparently uh, the diamond block is missing so let's uh, see we're supposed to go out the door and um, was it out the door to the left and down the street so let's see first let's check out and see what's in here these might be useful well thank you I think they just might be useful now, there's a texture pack that comes with this, but I can't get it to work. It's based off of Painterly, and I'm playing this in 1.5.2, and apparently I don't have Optifine. I still can't figure out how to do that with this new launcher. So, um, let's see, I'm not going to need to eat right now. Anything useful in the furnace? Nope. There's our... Did you hear that? I heard a... Yeah. Yes, I hear a, um, what do you call that? A portal and a large cave sound. Mm -hmm. Oh, let's go check this chest over here. Oh, a reminder by Sherlock Holmes. And some more torches. Put all our torches right there. Hmm, I guess that's our leather cap. We don't need that just yet. And a piece of wool. Well, you never know when a piece of wool will come in handy, so we'll take that. And I think that's our only chest. Okay, so what is the, what is the reminder that Sherlock Holmes has sent for himself? Hmm, I've last racked Moriarty's location. Oh, I think it's tracked. Moriarty's, it must be Professor Moriarty, location to Germany coupled with the past locations he has visited, it may point to the fact that he's after something. 
it must be valuable if he is using all this time to, and resources to locate this item seems to be af he seems to be after I must check for any connections between those locations when I get the time. Okay, let's set that up here because that, uh, so he's been tracking Professor Moriarty, which of course he always is, because they're like, aren't they like arch enemies? Ooh, let's see, is there any other places we can go? No? So this must be their, like their brownstone flat or something? Ooh. Oh, so I was saying I wasn't able to get the um, texture pack that comes with with the map to work. So I am using Monkey Farms uh, texture pack, which um, apparently we get to go to the Nether at some point. Ooh, there's a sign in there. How do I get in there? Hmm. I want to get in there. No. No. I guess not. All right, let's go downstairs. I guess we need to go. Okay, this must be like the drawing room or this. What do they have? Oh, it's a kitchen. It's a kitchen. Oh, neat. I like how he did the. How they did the um. What is that? The stove top. Oh, okay, this is the little courtyard. There's the window we were just looking out of. Okay, so that's the kitchen. This must be like the sitting area. And that's locked. And that's going to be locked. So those are iron doors. Okay, so let's go outside. He said go to the left, to the first intersection, and then I think it was turn right. What's in here? Hmm. Okay, first we need to go to the mansion and talk to... Okay, that looks like a mansion to me. So we're going to the Bernard Mansion to speak to the Bernards. Hello, peoples. Hello, hello. I hear somebody sounds like... Oh. And apparently Bernard is spelled with a K. Interesting. Maybe they're from Germany. Ooh, nice fountains. Doesn't that sound like somebody sweeping up water or canoeing in the uh, fountain? Let's go check just to be sure. So, yeah, listen to that. That's weird. Ooh, pretty. Pretty fountain. Okay. Enough sightseeing. We'll sightsee later. See, there it is again. Some, some guy sweeping the, the thing. Okay. Open it. Oh, somebody has already been to the mansion and left the front door open. Open, entering the mansion. Okay, let's watch that one. Ah, you must be the legendary Sherlock Holmes, along with his trusty associate, Dr. Watson. Pleased to meet you. I understand the matter is urgent. May we speak with the lady of the house? I will get her right away. Mr. Holmes, Dr. Watson, please come in immediately. What is the situation, Miss Bernard? Earlier today, my maid was making her rounds on the third floor and discovered that the diamond block, which usually sits in the library, was missing. She told me and I summoned you immediately. And the police? I notified them and they say that they, they'd send someone over later, but I felt better at sending you as well. Your reputation precedes you. Thank you. Now, who was in the house at the time of the crime? Myse myself, of course, and the six members of my staff. My butler, maid, personal assistant, gardener, chef, and nanny. You don't think one of them did this, do you? We shall see. I wish to speak with all of them. Well, they'll be somewhere either on the first two floors of the house or on the grounds. I told everyone to stay out of the third floor, since that is the crime scene. An excellent idea. I shall have a look there as well. You are free to move about the house, and thank you both very much. You are very welcome, madam. So, Holmes, what do you wish to find first? What? That made no sense. So, Holmes, what do you wish to do first? Interview the staff members, or check out the crime scene? Let us go to the third floor and examine the crime scene. 
Then we'll talk to the suspects. I study the house's layout, and we need to go to the second floor, enter one of the wings, and head into the master's be master bedroom. The stair to the library is are there. Okay, so they are saying that um, so Miss Katya. Hey, oh, that's what it is. They're walking in the grass. <laughs> the grass must need to be mowed. All right, so Miss Katya says a maid found the block missing while she was working on the third floor in the library and that there are six staff members in the house when the block was stolen and we can go talk to all six of those people and the let's see that would be the butler the maid the personal assistant the gardener the chef and the nanny and I have to say I, I laughed when uh, when Miss Bernard splashed uh, Watson with whatever she had, she just threw it right at him. That was too funny. Uh, first, they say, let's see, Sherlock wants, or we, are going up to the library first. So let's do that. The guy walking all over. He's walking all over our, the yard. Me. I should put a sign out. Okay. Wow, this is a big mansion. Uh, who is this? Oh, that's the butler. Okay, but it said we need to first go... I'm going to shut this door. That just bothers me. <laughs> uh, ooh, big big picture. You know what we do with big pictures. Ooh, that's a nice picture, too. Okay, we always... Oh, Lord. <laughs> a big picture that sounds like a cow. That scared me. All right, upstairs we have to go find the library, which is in the master bedroom. And that's what I want. I want a master bedroom. Ooh, I like that picture. Okay, couldn't get through there. I hear water though. That's odd. Okay, that's too little. Ooh, who is this? The maid. Oh, we will come back and talk to you in a little bit, ma'am. What is that? Oh, it must be the backyard. <laughs> oh, look at that. Chinese buffet. I love Chinese buffet. Oh, <laughs> maybe I shouldn't look out the window. Apparently we're on an island. Okay, so still haven't seen a master bed. Wow. Either that's the bathroom back there or they've got a big leak somewhere. Uh, what's this? Could this be the master bedroom? Yeah, I think it might be. Who is this? Okay, this is Katya. So this is definitely the master bedroom. I love these windows. The details in this map. Oh, okay, there's a flower garden and some kind of a shed. There's town. The rest of town. Okay. So, we're supposed to go find the library. This looks like a closet. Anything in the closet? Uh -huh. Lots of wool. More wool. That must be all her clothing. Her unmentionables. Okay, so... Ah, yes. Here we are in the library. So let's see, where would we display, you would think it'd be right there, where would we display a large diamond block if we had a huge library? What is this? Oops. Looks like some kind of book. Hmm, okay. That might be useful. A log book. Doesn't say anything. Okay, we come down that way. Let's see. Ooh. Oh, oh, okay. This is where we came in. Oh, nice. Ah, here's something. Okay, what is this? Open. Oh, a lever. Ooh, a lever. <laughs> you know what we say about levers. Wait a minute. Ah ha ha! What is that? Let us go see. I heard it to my left. Oh, 
Oh, it's on the other side. Okay. Alright, let's go check that real quick. I heard it to my left. Ooh, a doorway. Hmm. What could be in here? A window looking into town. Okay. Oh, and a chest. The Book of Secrets. Don't look at page 47. Well, you know what that means. We're going straight to page 47. Unfortunately, it's not a book we can actually open, so... Ooh, I wonder if that... Hmm. Interesting. It's just a shelf. Okay, let's go back to the crime scene, and it said, Open the crime scene doohickey. Okay, so let's do that now.